a life flight. So they were trying to stable, <laughs> stabilize her to get her in a helicopter and get her to whatever ER they felt was uh, appropriate. Today, the jury got to hear from that man who was on the rust set the day cinematographer Helena Hutchins was shot and killed. That's right. Jurors are continuing to hear the case against the movie's armorer. That's Hannah Gutierrez Reed, who was charged with involuntary manslaughter and tampering with evidence. Spencer shot was in the courtroom all day for us. So Spencer, fair to say we learned a lot from this afternoon's testimony. Yeah, Trevor, we really got an inside perspective today of what happened in that church on the set of Rust when the gun went off. The firearm went off in a small wooden church, so the concussion, ears ringing, that moment of panic in everybody. Um, I think the first person I made eye contact with was, was Elena, who was clearly injured by whatever that gunshot was that noise we had just heard and in fact she was starting to go flush and uh, I think holding her her right side Adego testified that day on set was more chaotic than usual now he's worked on more than a hundred other movie sets and says even before the gun went off there was some chaos he pointed out to sit that six members of the camera crew walked off set that morning and they had to scramble to find their replacements he also testified throughout the production safety standards were not always up to par with the standards he was used to from his experience on working on other movie sets he also called out actor Alex Baldwin for rushing the production and he called out Hannah Gutierrez Reed for not properly keeping track of the firearms while on set. She wasn't necessarily as uh, serious or professional as I'm accustomed to with the other armors that I've worked with. What do you mean? Give us an example. Um, I recall walking by her uh, cart a number of times and firearms and or uh, bandoliers or ammo belts being left out on the cart uh, unsecured. Um, I don't know that I've ever seen an armor pull loose ammo out of a fanny pack. Now, Adego also testified that he believes that Hannah Gutierrez Reed was the one who loaded the live round into the gun that eventually killed Helena Hutchins. But her defense attorney asked Adego point blank if he saw Gutierrez Reed load the gun that day, and he testified no, he did not. Now, the defense also brought up the fact that Adego has a pending lawsuit against Alec Baldwin and the producers of Rust, but who's not named on that lawsuit is Hannah Gutierrez Reed. So the defense is really sticking to their guns on their core argument in this case that Gutierrez Reed is being used as a scapegoat to protect Baldwin and other producers. Back to you guys.